Hello guys, in this video I am going to show you how to generate 60 Hz of frequency with 50% duty cycle. So let's get started. We are going to use 4.9152 MHz crystal oscillator and we need 60 Hertz of frequency. Now this we can write it as 4.9152 multiplied by 10 to the power 6 Hertz and this is equal to 4.9152 Hertz. We are using 4060 frequency divider IC. I already explained about this IC in the first video of this series and we know that pin number 2 of this IC can divide a frequency by 8192 so if we divide this number by 8192 then we get 600 now if we divide this 600 by 10 so we'll get 60 hertz and we know that 4017 is decade counter IC that is divided by 10 so this is the basic calculation for this circuit now we'll see the circuit diagram here it is IC 4060 and it is 4017 this is dividing a frequency by 8192 and this is dividing a frequency by 10 these are the power supply pin for both the IC. Now see it's pin number 10 and 11. In between these two pin, we'll connect the crystal oscillator and parallel with this, we'll connect a resistor. The value of the resistor is 1 mega ohm. And with this pin, we'll connect one capacitor. The value of the capacitor is 20 picofarad. With this also, we are going to connect this capacitor. The frequency of the crystal oscillator is 4.9152 MHz. Its pin number 2 is connected to pin number 14 of this 4017. And we will take the output from pin number 12. From here we will get 60 Hz of frequency with 50% of duty cycle. Now we will see the breadboard connection and the output. This is the crystal oscillator. And this is the 20 picofarad ceramic capacitor. Here it is 4060 IC and it is 4017 IC. And these pins are already connected to power supply. Put the crystal oscillator. One pin is connected to the pin number 11 and the other one to the pin number 10. One mega ohms is connected and then the both the capacitor is connected. Pin number 2 of this IC is connected to pin number 14 of this IC. Both the negative rails are connected. Now we can take the output from pin number 12. Connecting the 5 volt power supply. Here I am connecting the oscilloscope. Ground is connected. And the channel 1 is connected to pin number 12 of this IC. Now we are getting 60 Hertz. Sometimes it is showing 60.02 Hertz and sometimes it is showing 59.95 Hertz. So we can take it as 60 Hertz and the duty cycle is 50%. Okay. So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.